hello guys and welcome to another tutorial video and in this video we are going to be talking about coin market cap now if you do not know coin market cap popularly known as cmc uh, it is a price tracking platform and um, crypto investors crypto traders crypto enthusiasts use this platform to track price data market data of most of their favorite cryptocurrencies now coin market cap tracks um, a whole lot of data over 12,000 cryptocurrencies and their price activities now if you would like to get this downloaded on your mobile device uh, you can visit your app store or your google play store and then you would like to search for coin market cap and then when it pops out you click on coin market cap crypto tracker um, please make sure it has adequate rating as usual make sure it's the correct platform and then after downloading it you just click open and it will launch your coin market cap for you all right so the home page has all the navigation tools you need to navigate around coin market cap and as you can see this it is on coins it means it's going to be displaying all the coins from the first to the last 100 and then you have a preference of looking at it in usd or in btc right here and then you have the access of looking at it by the 24 hour percentage or you change it to the one hour seven days or 30 days also you can choose between top 100 top 200 top 500 or all the coins but you know many people just like to stick to top 100 now if you move to watch list watch list is a list of your favorite tokens that you don't want to be scrolling to look for them you don't want to search for them you just want to add them to a particular category to keep watching and um, understanding their price movement so that's what you do on watch list now you can click on this plus sign to add tokens to your watch list after you are done or if you want to remove you click on the select button down there and then you go back and all those tokens will be added to your watch list if you also want to remove you just swipe to your left and then click on remove swipe to your left click remove swipe to your left click remove if you would like to add you just click on add coins and then you search for example you search for wikicat and then it pops up click on done and then you select the coin now wikicat has been successfully added to your watch list also if we move to the categories section this session groups all the cryptocurrencies according to their ecosystem so you can see this is very handy you can see the bmb chain ecosystem and then also you can see the total market cap in it you can see that and in this ecosystem you can see down below the most trending of the tokens in the ecosystem and then you have the solana you have avalanche then you have DeFi, you have nft and collectibles you have poco dot you have metaverse play to earn storage tokens and uh, the heco ecosystem now this just groups all the uh, cryptocurrencies into their ecosystems now let's say you want to just you know go around any ecosystem you just select on it for example bnb chain ecosystem now you see all the bnb chain supported tokens so you can scroll down all the way and find out if your favorite token is on the bnb chain ecosystem now this is very handy and very 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 articulate also if we move to the exchanges category now this brings out the list of all the exchanges listed on coin market cap from their ranking of one all the way down to the bottom of 290 now this doesn't just rank them from 1 to 290 it also shows you their names and shows you their 24 hour trading volume and shows you the score which means their trust score how many people interact with them and how satisfied these people are for example you can see number one being binance and you can see they have a 24 hour trading volume of 76 billion and the score is 9.9 .9. so um, it's safe to say that you can interact with those who are first 10 and have good score 
please bear in mind that the rank of exchanges can vary based on the 24 hour trading volume and the score can also vary from time to time all right so having known all of that um we would now explain the explore feature down below and now here you can see the recently added coins or tokens you can see spotlight uh, spotlight is categorized into trending top gainers and top losers also you have news you can see the news for you latest and by alexandria so um if you click on see more for recently added it will show you the list of recently added tokens and the time they were added their prices and their names also spotlight if you click on see more you can see all the tokens on spotlight top gainers you can see all the tokens that are doing very well in the past 24 hours and top losers you can see all the tokens that are doing terribly in the last 24 hours so if we go back here you have news for you these are news selected for you you have the latest news and you have those on um, alexandria so if you click on see more you are going to see more news click on latest you see more news on latest click on for you and then you see more news for you this has been um actually grouped into order of preference so this is what the explore button does so the next one will be the portfolio button now for me i've created uh, a portfolio before and now you can see that uh, all the tokens i put in my portfolio have been summed up to my current balance it uh, tracks each of them and sums it up for you and uh, for example you can see my wiki card uh, it says 10 trillion wiki card worth 1741 you can check details profit or loss average buy price and so on and so forth so this is a portfolio feature very good for you to group all your tokens that you own across all platforms and look at it on just one platform so i really use this a lot and it's very nice also you have the community so this just um groups different communities if you would like to engage in any community find out what's happening in that community check their chat their comments get informed with any community this is where you go to if you would like to also write you can see this um, icon here it looks like a pen you just click on it and then you write how you feel about the market today and then you can post it so if you click on your profile icon you can check for price alerts if you click on that uh, price alert um, you can just search for your cryptocurrency for example add from watch list you can just add wikicat and then enter target price so i can put if wikicat gets to let's say one dollar here set alert and then it's there so anytime wikicat gets to a dollar or above a dollar you will be alerted so you can always edit this by coming back to write anything maybe 05 and then set alert for it so anytime wikicat gets to that price or above it, you will be notified so if you are done here the next place should be converter so you can actually um, use this effectively to understand the dollar cost of any of your favorite tokens for example you can change um, btc to uh, wkc and wkc is wikicat and then uh, you can put a thousand dollars worth of wikicat and that will give you five trillion seven hundred and forty one billion one hundred and three million eight hundred and twenty thousand nine hundred and four pieces of wikicat tokens for a thousand dollars so this is how converter works you can also use it for btc if you select btc here you change this to let's say a thousand dollars you want to find out how much a thousand dollar worth of btc is you put it in there and then you can see how many btcs you'll be getting for a thousand dollars also you have the compare feature now this compare feature already groups um, btc versus ethereum and then you can see the 24 hour price change you can also see the market cap change you can see the volume and then you can set your preference to either 1 hour, 24 hours, 7 days, 30 days, 90 days, 1 year or select all time price movement for both pairs. You can see that. So also you can see the market stats and the market stats is grouped into the prices. 
and their all-time percentage changes you can see that uh, market cap also and you can see the 24 hour volume circulating supply maximum supply active since their rank and then portfolio balance for yourself now this is very awesome we can see that uh, coin market cap is a very very versatile tool very effective if you use it to your advantage you stay properly informed and organized so i'll urge you to play around coin market cap and try to understand most of these features very well for yourself and i wish you the best of luck